Now, speaking of good times over the weekend, it was a kind of a heart-pounding weekend in sports. Mike has a wrap of your NFL highlights. Mike? Thank you, Nick. Another exciting week of play in the NFL where this week fe featured many bizarre storylines. And hey, the Cowboys and Eagles are at 3-5, and five, and I can't even begin to express how displeased their fans are. But first, as we begin our Cube Sports Weekly Wrap-Up, the Giants were playing for a lot more this Sunday. They were playing for their neighbors and fellow community as Hurricane Sandy swept through New York City, destroying homes, cars, family, and anything in its path. Giant Steelers playing for the people of New York. Ben Roethlisberger hooking up with Mike Wallace. Wallace embarrassing Giants defenders with his speed. We saw a lot from Wallace in this game. Steelers win 24-20. More from this game in just a bit. How about some Titans and Bears for you in the fourth quarter? And man, oh man, is Chris Johnson starting to turn it on. 82-yard touchdown run from Johnson. He had a total of 161 yards on 16 carries. Bears all over the Titans, 51-21. What is going on in Dallas? Tony Romo throws for 324 yards and no turnovers as this hookup to Kevin Ogletree. However, he still can't find a way to win. Falcons remain undefeated. Wild card game for you. Bills, Texans, Matt Schaub connecting with Owen Daniels, the tight end. 39-yard hookup. Texans win 21-9. How about Houston at 7-1? In Cincinnati, Peyton Manning solidifying his case for MVP with that touchdown to Eric Decker. Denver wins 31-20 with that win. Denver at 5-3. Eagles and Saints. Drew Brees, one of his many touchdowns to Marquise Colston. How about this, Brees? 51st consecutive game with a touchdown. Saints hold off the Eagles 28-13. Both teams surprisingly at 3-5. and five. Making some headlines before the Giants-Steeler game was the Steelers' decision to fly into the game opposed to taking up hotel rooms that people affected from the hurricane might need. A very classy move, certainly from a very classy first-class organization of the Pittsburgh Steelers. Certainly nice to see the team lending a helping hand there.